This reading is for Aquarius for the month of October, year 2024. Please check your moon, your rising, and your Venus. Please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Hit the like button, share, and subscribe. This is a general reading. Allah, please send Aquarius 200 angels to stand, guard, guide, and protect. Allah, please send me 200 angels to stand, guard, guide, and protect me as I open this portal. I do not partner you with my divine nation, but I ask of you to guide me through so that my readings are truthful, accurate, and honest. Why is the first card out for Aquarius? Choose your words carefully. Well, dearest wishes come true is in reverse. So basically, somebody doesn't put it like this. You wish somebody would shut the hell up and stop running their mouth, or this is how they feel about you. Your dearest wishes did not come true. Why? What's going on with Aquarius? Why is choose your words carefully here and dearest wishes come true in reverse? Yep, somebody better watch their damn back. They done ran out of time. They're in stormy weather. It's time for someone to be quiet. It's time for someone to stop running their mouth. Somebody has to watch their back. They're running out of time. They're in stormy weather. Allah, please confirm, choose your words carefully, wishes and desires in reverse, watch your back, upright, running out of time, and stormy weather. Who is this for Aquarius? Aquarius. Star card. Wow. So if this isn't you, somebody has lack of motivation, but I can't. This is you. Lack of motivation. You could actually see a mental illness in yourself or someone close to you. There's uh, some doubt Someone's dwelling in the past. Someone's not moving. They're not moving to, towards their goals. Well, I did ask who this was, and the star card is Aquarius, so there's no healing. Someone needs to get up. They need to move their feet. They need to go towards goals. They need to have motivation here. Someone could be lacking some strength. Somebody literally like wish someone just be quiet. Why is the star card in reverse for Aquarius? Somebody's not healed. If this is not you, this person is a drag on. They're a drag on, which means they drag on situations, repeated situations. Justice is here. So you could be trying to have balance here. But there's not going to be any true balance because there's lack of motivation. There's lack of movement. There's money issues also. Someone's trying to remain balanced in this, but they're not healed. There's doubt. Why is the star card here in reverse with justice upright? That's not a good, you can't balance that out. What I tell you about the money issue, six of pentacles. Six of pentacles is in reverse. Ten of pentacles is in reverse. Okay, so there is some lack of money, lack of finances, lack of investments. Um, there's no give and take. There's not enough to give. You got the, the family that you're possibly not giving to or vice versa. But there's loss of money here. 
because somebody went back to their old ways. Somebody literally went back to their old ass ways. Mismanagement of funds is also here. Show me the six of pentacles in reverse with the ten of pentacles in reverse. Somebody went back to their old ways, old way of thinking. Allah, you are the all-seeing, all-knowing, all-hearing. There could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and involved Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. King of Wands. Sagittarius. You can have fire in your chart. You can have earth in your chart. King of Swords. Two of Swords. So you're blocked. You're feeling blocked. There's some denial here. Your finances, your work life is blocked. Somebody refused to get up and... and, and Make changes. Show me this King of Wands, King of Swords, Two of Swords, and the Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, player, Knight of Wands. Knight of Wands. Somebody's not a king here. They're actually a knight. They're playing around. They're playing around with the Ten of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles in reverse with the Star card in reverse. Somebody's not motivated to put in the work and invest in themselves. Somebody's in denial, the Two of Swords. They're blocking their money because they don't want to get up and they don't want to work. That's your karma. Whoever this is, there's karma for that. What goes around comes around the past is catching up with someone. Somebody is in their own karma. What I'm seeing here is somebody played themselves. And I'm, I'm telling you the truth. This is an Aquarius that played themselves. Yeah, I can be mad all you want. I asked God who energy with this and the star card came out in reverse. So there's an Aquarius somewhere that's played themselves. There's no investment. There's no growth. But they're looking for justice being in balance with the star card in reverse. That's that king of wands and justice looking like everything is balanced out, but it's not. Really, they're the knight of wands. Show me more for this Aquarius. Why are they receiving karma? Four of pentacles. Four of pentacles is being greedy. An inheritance, gift, a large sum of money leads to arguments, possessiveness, and selfishness. You try to keep all the money for yourself. It is foolish to try to control others' actions and situations around you. Resistance to change is affecting your judgment. A contract is signed or agreement is reached. You will be in a position of authority. So that's, that, that's also that King of Wands energy. Like you are in a position of authority, but someone's not working on themselves. They're not working on productive um, energy here. They're, they're sitting back and they're doing nothing. They're doing nothing. Nothing. They refuse to change. Whoever this Aquarius is, they refuse to change. Look at that. Four of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles, Two of Swords. Damn, 
This is no damn change. That's just blocked energy like constipation. Why is this happening to this Aquarius? Six of Wands is in reverse. There's no new goals. There's 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 no new ideas. The abandoned prod like projects. Okay, like whatever it is that someone once was working on, they just stopped. Someone has too much pride and ego. They turn away from accomplished people. They take credit. So someone could be you is taking credit, takes credit. Six of Wands, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius is in reverse. And then you got karma here. So even if you go back to old way of thinking or doing something, okay, that is from the past when you're supposed to move forward, you're putting yourself in karma. There's some Aquarius that I see that's filled with blockages, Okay, filled with blockages. They find it comfortable. Some, of what I'm seeing, y'all could get mad like I said. There's some Aquariuses that feel so comfortable sitting on their ass. They prefer to get hands out. Hands out. Okay, can I borrow? Can I have? This reading is not for all Aquariuses. But you cannot say that a law is not true because the Six of Pentacles is in reverse with the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody needs to work. You got a queen of wands here that came out in reverse. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. This person only works if they have to. This person is witchy. This person thinks that they're attractive, but it's only aloof. This person plays with other people's heads. Okay, so somebody plays with people's heads here. Show me the queen of wands in reverse for Aquarius. Three of swords. Cruelty and abuse. Sat your ass down. So, you could have had been rejecting the hand of God. You could have been rejecting a lot of offers for the Ten of Pentacles to be upright and the Six of Pentacles to be upright. You rejected the blessings. And this Leo Aries Sagittarius that's filled with cruelty and abuse, this person is tied to your stagnation. How is this person tied to the stagnation? Somebody is comfortable. The devil. The devil. The dude. Could be a Capricorn involved. But this Queen of Wands, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Three of Swords is filled with cruelty and abuse. This person got a strong grip being obsessed with you. A strong grip of addiction. Possessiveness is here. This person is the one that's holding you back, holding you up. Or you could have had did this to a fire sign, but the queen of wands is in reverse. So this is somebody that doesn't want to work. This is somebody that doesn't want to do a damn thing. They only work if they have to, and it's a short period of time. This person, they probably, you know, has a lot of cruelty and abuse with them. It could be you. But there's a strong tie to the devil with this queen of wands, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Excuse me. There's a lot of judgment here. So can't really blame, can't really blame um, anyone else for this. This is what you allowed. Show me, okay, yep, there's no truce. There's nothing but conflict. The four of swords in reverse is lack of strength. Strength card is in reverse. Someone can't argue their own point of view. Someone's unrealistic and they're unreliable. 
there's conflict when it comes to a project or getting together. Every time it, someone has to go to work, there's always some damn conflict. Someone's creating hold up blockages. There's conflict that's holding everything up. So someone has to prepare and update a will. There will be changes that to, to affairs that no one can control. Conflict is going to continue to dominate your life with this person. So what's the outcome for Aquarius? What's the outcome for Aquarius? There's a lot of fighting and arguing in a relationship. Six of Cups. There's also some witchcraft here. There's some damn witchcraft. That Queen of Wands, this bitch that I keep seeing that comes out in reverse. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, whoever this Aquarius is that watches me. Okay, you're with a witch. You're with someone that manipulates um, the truth, energy. This person is, is a liar. Could be you. Okay. But there's a lot of fighting and arguing in, in a relationship. This is why the wish fulfillment isn't um, upright. The wish fulfillment desires is, is, is in reverse. Somebody has to watch their back. You possibly feel like you always got to watch your back with this person or you, um, this person has to watch their back. Either you or someone else has to watch their back here, but somebody's a slacker. Somebody doesn't want to work. They went back to old way of thinking. There's no changes, just a lot of blockages. A lot. Give me out this reading. Ah. A lot. Help me close this reading out. Thank you, a lot. Yeah, no work. There's conflict at work or at home. Three of Pentacles is in reverse. Emperor is in reverse. You could be a man or could be a man involved. Um, someone is pretty much, they, they're seeing things in, in black and white. Okay. They think that they can sit on their ass for half their life and receive blessings. That It doesn't work that way. Somebody's a bully here. They're domineering. Somebody really wants to control and they don't no one here has any control even the witchcraft that that shit ain't even strong enough you got to understand we're stronger than that and if you're that weak to the point where you're allowing a queen of wands in reverse to stop block you then to each its own this is what you are allowing this is what you are allowing. There's more to life than this. You have the Hierophant here, which this is church. It's God. It's organization. It's higher learning. Okay. Well suited for a career in education. Medicine, higher learning, knowledge, spiritual, religion, knowledge, skills, teamwork. You could be necessary, like placed in a job that is necessary and it will give you contentment. You have to bend to authority and do what you will, are expected to do. Watch out for ethical conflicts. Choose the moral path. Your need for social approval affects your decision. So some of you could be well suited for a career that you're, you're not doing. There's too many imbalances here. And this puts you in the five of cups because there's a lot of jealousy and conflict and a lot of gossip and a lot of talk. There could be children involved. Some of you could possibly feel stuck, feel restricted. Well, maybe this truth here is going to wound you. Nine of Wands and the Ace of Swords. The truth is wounding, it's, but it's healing. 
because there was a lot of offers that you had received and they all ended up to, you know, being ending death, Scorpio, death ending to your blessings because some of you were so still caught up in a damn illusion. But yeah, there's heavy witchcraft here. You're caught up in an illusion. You got to free yourself. This is why you were stuck. Some Aquarius, as I do see, is trying to trap a fire sign. <laughs> Try to restrict them. You think I don't see that? But as this Queen of Wands is in reverse, you're dealing with the witch. You could be the witch or warlock, but um, there's some blockages here that was created yeah, by some... Um, Illusion, some witchcraft. You're going to have to break yourself free from that to move forward. But from what I'm seeing, for some, karma feels better to just sit there and do nothing. See, you got to get up. You got to move your body. You got you to gotta look for, um, you know, a job or go back to school or, you know, have some new ideas involved. That's going to break this witchcraft there. But somebody wants you to sit down, sit still, don't move. OK, so in the arguing and fighting, it confirms choose your words carefully. So, yeah, there's a lot of um, bumping heads going on, but this is what's been holding you back. The moon, the illusion, the devil and the magician. You got to free yourself, Aquarius. Aquarius. 